It's been a quick minute since I've seen you here in Five to Know. I was on vacation, but no worries. I'm back here for good. Let's jump into it. Netflix dropped the trailer for Wine Country with a tough to beat cast starring the likes of Amy Poehler, Maya Rudolph. Check it out May 10th. If you drink fancy coffee, chances are you've heard of Oatly. That's become popular across the US in recent years as more and more people look for alternatives to dairy products in their coffee and lattes and all the other foo foo things. This is where I need to stop you. I don't know what Oatly is, so I'm gonna have to Google it. It was like everyone knows what this is except me, and I don't like it. For half gallon, it's five dollars. That's a lot. Oh, can I have my frappuccino with Oatly? What? No. I've, I've never heard anyone say that. The U.S. demand for the company's products has far outstripped supply. Oatly now wants to expand to China. I'll get back to you and let you know if I find Oatly. YouTube star Olivia J. Giannoli is devastated by the allegations that her parents are facing during this whole college admissions scandal. Her parents are Lori Laughlin and fashion designer Massimo Giannoli. I mean, of course she's devastated. She was a 19-year-old who had a makeup deal with Sephora. What a mess. What do you expect? A woman in Florida was left with serious injuries after driving straight into an oncoming train. Look at this. Finally, here's a mini recap of what happened on last season's Game of Thrones. There's a big White Walker situation. Jon Snow and Daenerys are together. Cersei might be pregnant with her brother's baby, and there's only one dragon now. This is Five to Know. I'm Nat Cardona. I will see you on Monday.